I've seen this on my delivery. I thought I'd share with you. Okay, so let me explain what's going on. So, <clears throat> the TSX is going lower. I'm going to lower the back. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to clear it. I might have to camber just a little more, but I'm going to go a little lower on the rear. Because, like, it's been bugging me on, like, it's like a little tilted. I want to just, like, you know. <clears throat> um, I got the axle nut for the... I said axle nut. I meant the axle uh, socket to remove it. I said it twice, but this is what I meant. Brembo, so I could just do it with my gun. Um, I got that from work. Shout out work. Uh, I just need one more thing. If you guys saw the last video where I did the gaskets, first off, if you didn't, go see that. But if you guys saw that, I showed you guys the, the boot from the lower ball joint of one of them that ripped. It's not, like, horrible, <clears throat> but I'm trying to get another ball joint so I can put that boot on top of that boot, and then that's it. So I finally got the axle on that, so at least I got a couple of days off now. I just, if I can go get that boot, it's, it's done, though. At least if I can do one side, because <clears throat> he's about to go into surgery month, so I'm at the daily, the, the 70. I'm going to put him uh, right here, and then I'll do the, I think it's the right side. I'll do the whole Brembo, finish up, you know, bleed it or whatever, you know. And then I'll just put this one on when I got the lower uh, boot. Because I just got to do the boot. It's hella easy. Do the boot, and then I can slap it on. We'll be finished with that. So, to be real, <clears throat> after that. Like I said, I'm still finishing up. I still need hella shit. To be for real, I'm like... I'm not where I want to be. It's just like I wish the car was more built already. Like, I'm trying my best. I'm, like, really trying to build it. Like, but it does get, like, frustrating sometimes. Because, like, I want to be somewhere where I want to be already. Uh, So, that's why I've been saving up, like, some bread. So I can either turbo it or supercharge it. And then I'll feel like I got more speed, you know what I mean? Supercharge is cool, but I seen like I seen like dyno sheets on the supercharge. And I don't know. Like at least the TSX ones, they were like two like two forty. Like they were kinda low. And I seen that all power, and it still at least hits 250. So I don't know. But for today, we're going to be lowering the whip. I want to cl clean up the stance. Like, yeah, I could still be quick, but, like, I could be a little lower. Like, you know what I mean? Just for now. Um, I wanted to also get new coilovers, but i just been cheap. Like, I got the bread now, but I'm just, like been hella cheap like i'm just like damn do i really want to spend a rack i mean like, i'm already lowered you know so i'm just like i'm still debating on that one yeah let's lower this car see how it looks i'm gonna have to figure out the camber in the rear because like i did this a long time ago and like this was like when there was fires i did a video actually like in the on my history I, I did a video where I did the SPC, like, the first camber kit. And, like, dude, I was there for, like, two days. So, I hope uh, this shit doesn't take too long. But I'm already, like, four minutes in talking, my bad. Uh, let's get to it. Let's go. All right, here's my ride height before. It's not horrible. I mean... You know, it's still okay. My bad, I do have to wash the car. This is how the rear was. This is what we're gonna focus on today. All 
All right, now we're just gonna lower it. I'm right here and I was pretty low. What if I go like maybe right here? Fuck it. Yeah, I'm gonna need a fly. Um. All right, <clears throat> so I adjusted it. This is where I'm stopping at. I had a socket and a lug nut. I was uh, way up here. So let's see. And I added more camera. I twisted it like four times, maybe four or five times. So I tilted more that way. Um, I'm gonna slap it on, see how it looks. Done. Actually did a little bit. It's not where I want it though. Kinda. Let's see if it's hitting stuff. Damn, that's crazy. I'm Gucci. Just slamming them. So this was number tr try number two. It's looking much better much better you can barely see the tire now um but i'm gonna go test three i'm gonna camber and lower just a little more and camber just a little more it's just not where i want it yet i was getting there that should looking crazy all right i'm gonna test drive it go around the block when i do the other side it was good right side actually the left side is good let me see if i could drive it out though so yeah i couldn't even drive out the right side is like rubbing it's rubbing bad actually gotta fix the right just a little bit so I called the, the homie Alex, uh, the stance guard, the one with the, sometimes I put him in them in the pictures. He has the white BMW. Um, he told me cut the inside cause it's hitting a little bit at the bumper. So I'm just gonna grind it. So this is the new ride height on the back. I feel like low key the camera went at more. I'm tripping on it. A little bit, actually. It's a finger, a finger now. I could have went out more, but that's cool. So y'all, what I did was uh, I ended up like grinding off a little more of my uh, rolled fender and i cut the bumper a little bit and it cleared so i'm not rubbing i'm not i am scraping my muffler in the middle but it's not like a lot you know it's like only if i hit like tough but i was able to clear it and it's gucci now so and i was able to drive comfortably it was like uh it wasn't all like you got a baby it and shit. Like I could step on it and I still ain't rubbing. So I just cut it with a grinder. So if you guys are looking to do stance and be actually cambered, you, that's what you do. Okay, so this is where I'm at. Fixed the back, lowered it, dumped it. It's like on point. Then look at this side. So I'm gonna go test driver and I'll see how it is. Guys, look where my exhaust is. Damn. So here's the new stance on the rear. I'm gonna be doing the front one soon because I do have the actual uh, camber kit. But the rear is going nice. I mean, I'm, I'm camber and low now. So, we're doing the front so, soon. 
I also have the throttle body ready to ship out for the winter. So I thought I'd put that in here. I'm gonna be doing that very soon, like probably tomorrow. So it's coming, bro. It's coming. Keep back, keep back.